Good morning. Today I'm gonna go to Austin with my parents. We're gonna tour UT, hopefully find something good to eat, and then spend the night. So just now I've woken up, I've packed my things a bit, and I'm gonna go upstairs, get something to eat, and then we'll be on our way. Biggest dorm on UT, and it's pretty huge. About 2,200 of our full capacity is just for West, and there's like another 1,500 in just for East. So between the two large, we are the largest residence hall in the United States. We are the third largest in the world. <laughs> I love fish tanks. I'm worried that this might be a bit overcrowded, but it's stunning nonetheless. What do you think of these fish tanks, Mom? I think this is a beautiful fish tank there. I can't hear you. It's uh, it's salt. It's a, it's a salt uh, tank. Oh, really? I think it's a salt water tank. You're a pro. Well, it's got fish then. You're not. That's actually wrong. That's not a salt water tank. Really? Those are cichlids. Even the blue ones? Yeah, those are what I used to have in my freshwater tank, Mom. In the hallway. Oh. That shows how much I remember. <laughs> my mom thought this was a salt water tank, but... No, no, no. These are African cichlids. Look at these babies! Mom, do you see the babies? You're not even looking. On the rock. Oh, yes. Oh. We should go in there. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. I've never been inside of Patagonia. Thank you. 
I need to do something physical right now. Is it empty in here? Empty fitness room. Great. Now to figure out how to work this stuff. I'm gonna run in Tevas because I did not bring my tennis shoes. I actually don't really know how this speed stuff works. Is that, I mean, what kind of speed is that? Is that two miles an hour or? That can't, that cannot be right. This is not two miles an hour. Actually, wait, maybe it is. something interesting before we leave. Good morning. Okay, and we are off on the second day. We're on our way to UT right now for a tour.
across from the Bill and Melinda Gates Computer Science Complex and behind you is the Jackson School of Geosciences. We refer to this college as the richest college on campus. Um, it is very, very small. This past year we only had a total of 23 students graduate from this college. Used to be a part of the College of Natural Sciences until they split and to make their own school. Gregory Gym, we have tons of stuff available for you. Down on the first floor, we have our cardio pit as well as 10 racquetball, handball, and squash courts. Apparently, there's a tournament going on right now, so that's pretty cool. On the third floor, we have our indoor basketball and volleyball courts. And on the fourth floor, we have an indoor sky track that is one seventh of a mile. So, if the weather's not too great outside for running, you can always use the indoor sky track and it's surrounded by windows, so you still get a great view of the campus. This is going to be the last stop on the tour, so we won't be outside walking around much longer. Uh, we're just outside of the tower area on campus. I'll kind of start geographically all the way from the south. So, if you turn around, you can see the capital of Texas State Building right behind you. What's interesting is that there's actually a law put into place in Texas that nothing can be built between the Capitol and the tower to obstruct that vision. So every single day walking through the main mall, the only thing that you will see is the George Washington statue um, as well as the entire downtown. bites me it's gonna bite me <laughs> I don't have any food oh wait yeah I do I totally do hi oh my god <laughs> he just took some chocolate granola at the cutest little French cafe place and then I got a picture with the host and he had red hair and an accent and I'm dying and now we're getting in the car to leave <laughs> great day So I just got home. I'm so glad I got to do that mini trip to Austin. I loved seeing Patagonia, UT, a bit of the nightlife, 6th Street. So that's it for this vlog. I'll see y'all soon. Bye.